Hi friends, we'll continue learning about option menu where we present a uh, set of options for the user to select one of the available options. Earlier we have discussed about the basics about the option menu. Now we'll try to increase the how to increase the font size of the option menu. We'll learn that. Then we'll move to how to get the uh, options from a database or from an Excel sheet or from different different data sources. We can get the options and present to the user. Before we move further, I'll, my request is please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so you'll be notified as and when we add new new tutorials and we are frequently doing that also. Let's move and create a option menu and then add the higher size font to it. We'll start from here. The first, this is a list. These list options uh, we'll use as options for our uh, option menu. So below that, the window, we are just given the width and height, then a title, then a string variable to capture the what the user has selected. Then we are setting the string variable to uh, second element. That means the second element here, it is two. So this element will be selected by default. User can change it. Now then now we have declared the option menu and placed it on a grid. You can note here that here in this place, we have unpacked our list, whatever you have declared at the top and that we have used it as uh, options for our option menu. Now below that, let me start a menu because I have to access to change the font. I have to access the menu and the options separately. So the menu, whatever appears at the top, menu equal to now my underscore w is my parent window dot name to widget now here i am telling om1 om1 is the object i have created the option menu at line number 11 om1 then menu name the name part i am accessing here so fine now what i will do now i will create two different fonts so om1 dot config i am configuring the option font option so i am configuring the font then I am giving it a, a list here, Arial. So this is the font style. Then the size, size I am putting it here as 26. You can change it, I'll write it. So this is the set the menu font. Now let's just go to OM, uh, sorry. Now I will access the, what are the user selection? This menu already I have created at the top at the line number 14, just above. Now that I am config now. Now I am using a config option. I am creating the again giving a font here. So here this time usually the options will be have a slightly lower font than the menu itself. So font I am giving it is here again Arial and next is 16. So I am giving a lower font size for the options to select for the users set option not the menu font, just the options, whatever is presented. Now let's just see how the, our things are changing. Here you can see this two, because it's selected, because at line number nine, you can see, we have set the string variable to second element. Zero is the first element, second. So second element is two here, you can see. So now the options are here. So this is taken font size of 16, and this two has taken the size of 26. That's all friends. Hope you have enjoyed this tutorial. In the next, we'll, move, we'll learn how to get the data uh, options from the different data sources. It can be MySQL database, SQLite database, or it can be a simple Excel also. From there, we'll take the options and present to the user to select one. So before we move, my request is please subscribe to our channel and uh, press the bell icon so you'll be notified as and when we add new new tutorials and we are frequently doing that also. And if you have any doubts, suggestions, questions or any ideas, use the comment section below to post it. Please share this with your friends and thank you for watching.